Next one is the group duration report. Group duration report is similar to assignee duration report, but instead of showing each assignee separately, this report shows values for groups of users. Using the groups button on the toolbar, you can select which user groups to include in the report and the total assignee duration of all users in each of the groups will be shown as a column in the report. This report type is particularly useful if you have multiple distinct groups of people working on the same set of issues. For example, if you are working with customers, you can see how much time the issues spent on your people and on customers. Or if you are operating a service desk and have level 1, level 2 support groups, you can see how much time issues spent on each level. If the issues spent time as unassigned, that will also be shown as a separate column in the report. The assignee duration for users that are not members of any of the selected groups will also be shown as a separate column in the report. If any user is a member of more than one of the selected groups, time and status will place a warning icon at the top of that column. 